Hi everyone, today we're going to talk about pollution. So what is pollution? Pollution refers to the significant presence of substances in the natural environment, which can occur in various forms such as air, water, soil, and noise, resulting in biodiversity, negatively impacting human health, and affecting overall life quality. Water pollution is caused by the salt toxic waste from underwater bodies. It can harm the aquatic ecosystem and living organisms such as animals and humans. It can lead to diseases like hepatitis and cholera. Of course, we can do something to prevent water pollution. Individuals can take steps such as taking short showers, checking for any leakage occasionally, etc. By addressing these issues, we can protect our ecosystem and prevent water pollution. Air pollution is caused by harmful particles and natural sources like volcanoes and eruptions and dust storms that negatively impact our health and ecosystem. Human activities such as smoking, burning fossil fuels, and driving cars contribute to the majority of air pollution. Do you know what happens if we burn fossil fuels? Well, it releases greenhouse gases, trapping heat that leads to global warming. We can reduce air pollution by raising awareness about its consequences and reducing fossil fuel usage as much as possible. That way, we can make the air we breathe healthier. Soil pollution caused by abnormal concentrations of toxic substances from human-made sources can lead to severe damage to living organisms and cause cancer, deformities, and skin problems. To prevent this, proper recycling, trash collection, reducing plastic usage, and proper disposal of harmful waste like batteries and computer parts are essential to keeping our land safer. Noise pollution is caused by both natural and man-made sources. It can cause permanent damage and hearing loss. Noise pollution can also cause mental health problems like stress, poor concentration, and communication difficulties. You can avoid presenting your TV volume to audible for you and others, stopping unnecessary honking in public and or private places, etc. Remember, having peace is very important for a well being. The video highlights the negative impacts of pollution and environment in our health. Emphasizing the need for making the right choices and cooperation to reduce and prevent pollution. It discusses the four types of pollution and their effects on biodiversity. The video encourages us to think about our actions to prevent further damage to our ecosystem and living organisms. Yes, the educational video made me realize that pollution can raise awareness about the significant role we humans play in, the, in harming the environment. The video emphasizes the negative consequences of human activity, such as industrial pollution, improper waste management, etc. These videos can inspire individuals to make the right choices towards eco-friendliness and maintenance to prevent environment degradation. What I liked the most about the video was that it taught me how pollution can affect humans, animals, and the environment. What causes it to happen and what we can do to prevent and reduce pollution. If there is something that I like the least about the video, then it would be about humans being irresponsible and lacking in understanding the importance of the planet we live In conclusion, the study of pollution has revealed the severe impact of human activity on the environment. It has highlighted the urgent need for sustainable solutions to solve pollution and protect our planet. By understanding the causes, consequences, and potential solutions of pollution, we can work towards a cleaner and healthier future for ourselves and future generations. I will keep in mind what Carl Sagan said, the Earth is the only world to have our life. There is nowhere else, at least in the near future, to which our species could migrate. Visit, yes, settle, not yet. Like it or not, for the moment, the Earth is where we make our stand.